What is going on, everybody? We are back. Come on, we're cruising. And man, all I've wanted to do, all that I've wanted to do is to cruise. <laughs> and uh, so I went back and I got the uh, gold trophies on all of our, uh, the three courses, the three tours um, that we played in the last video. So we still, I still haven't even touched the final three because we're going to do it for the first time in the recording. So let's go ahead and start off the chopper tour and I unlocked this badass super bike look at this shit though level 2 already and it's crazy fast dude it's crazy fast let's just keep it red and uh yeah I went and got all the gold trophies I still need to go and get all the keys there's lots to do man that's what I like to see And man, I've been looking into like raw thrills just because I'm just like, man, this game is so, so fun. Like, what else have these guys done? What? Yo, they totally got the jump on me. That's some goddamn horse shit, dude. <laughs> Ooh. Um, wow. This is some Fast and the Furious shit. How am I in 10th place? Woo! Yeah. The bike just taking down the car. So this is the Chopper Tour, so I guess it's like... Over-the-top action movie kind, kind of stuff. Woo! Oh, we gotta use our boosts. You gotta remember how short some of these tracks are. Come on, dude. Because here's the problem. In order to get to the next... In order to get to the next uh, tour, we need to gold rank... We need to get the gold in this one, right? Okay, good. <laughs> Going through it upside down, dude. Um. Yeah, and Roth Thrills, these guys have made a lot of crazy ass games. And so, I think last video I was talking about Hydro Thunder. Um, because again, these guys are a bunch of uh, former Midway, uh, former Midway guys. It's, I think the. The studio was founded by Eugene Jarvis, who's like uh, made a bunch of like classic arcade games back in the day. So there's just so much classic arcade DNA uh, in this team. And so, looking at their lineup, they made a game called H2 Overdrive, which is basically a Hydro Thunder like spiritual successor. And I'm just like, what? How have I not heard of a lot of this shit? They made some cool stuff. Ready, set, and I, I almost feel like these guys putting out a game on the Switch is kind of the product of the pandemic. Because no one's going to fucking arcades, right? So they're probably not making like any money. So it almost made sense for them to, to put the game out on Switch. Oh my god! <laughs> Do a fucking barrel roll, dude! That was crazy! Which... Yeah, I hope this game does well, because... If it results in them putting more of their games out on Switch... That would be goddamn amazing. Because I would love to see things like H2 Overdrive. Just more games out on, um... on console and part of like any console i think the reason why this one had to come out on the switch is i think cruising is owned is it owned by nintendo like the actual name 
That's why, like, cruising for the Wii was out only on the the Wii, right? What the fact check me on that one, dude. Oh shit, we gotta get going here. We gotta get a move on. Please, we gotta, we gotta boost, we gotta boost. Nitrous, use it, dude. Oh, this the fucking chopper is shooting, dude. This game is so crazy. Ooh, hope that doesn't slow me down. Hey, we got two of the three keys in that too. Fucking take it. cool cool tracks there's like really good variety in the tracks the only thing is, is like yeah they're hella short right i wonder if there's a way to like probably not i was like can you turn on having a lap system but i don't think that would work dude <laughs> this is the courses are like fundamentally designed in a very particular way right this is a cool ass looking course though Oh god. Apparently this game looks insanely good in handheld mode. Uh, which I haven't played yet. I've kind of like, I've only played a little bit. I mainly want to play it on uh, the recording. After this, once we unlock everything, I'll probably play more at my own leisure. Um, but apparently it looks really good in handheld mode. I was watching the... Uh, I was watching the Digital Foundry video on this game, which, dude, shoutouts to Digital Foundry. You're such an underrated channel. If you're, like, really into tech and graphics and performance and- Oh my god! That is a goddamn- place. That's a sprint, dude. 57 seconds? What the fuck? <laughs> That's a short ass course. Yo, but we're a three for three on the first place finish finishes, right? Give me some of that shit. Um, what was I talking about? I was talking about Digital Foundry. Great channel, very underrated. Even though they have like over a million subscribers. Um, but yeah, they just did a tech analysis on this game. It's like, I always find that kind of shit super interesting. Some people probably will find it boring as fuck, but if you're a goddamn nerd like I am, who's interested in that kind of stuff, yeah, they did a they did a really good breakdown on this game. And uh, the reason why like so many Switch games just don't look good, like on handheld mode, is because like it's obviously it's because like the resolution and stuff like that, but. Yeah, like, this game goes for, like, native resolution on the, uh, the Switch's handheld, on, like, the screen when you're in handheld mode. And so if you don't hit that, it's just gonna look like ass. Because, dude, there's some games where I'm just like, man, I put it in the handheld and it's just a fucking blurry mess, dude. Like, you can tell it's just, like, it's in, like, 540p or some shit. really can't... You can't get fucking lazy in this game, dude. You gotta... You gotta always be fighting for first place because the courses, they're so short. Let's go, let's go. Okay, first place is there. We're getting close, boys. Cruising blast! <laughs> Does it give you a bigger boost if you get a full drift going there? Okay, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. 
Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah, dude. Yes. First place. See, we've got it down, dude. Honestly, though, the the bike is kind of like it's almost easy mode because it's crazy fast. It's crazy fast. I think if you look at the stats on it, the, the speed's like maxed out, dude. Woo! Hell yeah. That was like the easiest one yet. Could be because of the bike. We'll see. We'll switch to something else. Maybe I should drive the... What was the big one that I unlocked? Was it the fire truck? Did I unlock a fire truck? I unlocked some bullshit. <laughs> we'll do that next. The dino tour, dude. Oh my god. What do we got? What do we got? Of course we unlocked the goddamn chopper. Are you serious? Oh, you need 10 keys to unlock that? You have to spend the keys too? The Rubino bullet. Oh god, yes. Look at the weight on this fucking big chungus. I wonder if you could take down other cars really easily with that. The police cruiser. Ah, okay, we're going with a fire truck. Can we... <laughs> Can we pimp this bitch out, dude? What do we got? What do we got? Give it some, like... Crazy-ass paint. Metallic paint. Sure. Should we just go classic? Hell yeah, dude. Red... Red ass fire truck. What does this even look like? We get a body kit for this bitch? <laughs> Come on, dude. Here we go. So I was playing some of the cruising games on my N64. And uh, one thing about this series is each installment gets incrementally more and more insane because <laughs> if you go back and play the first one which is cruise in usa very tame game right it's not really crazy by any stretch holy shit you take down some of these fools Oh my god, throw my fucking weight around, dude. <laughs> Wait, why does the fire truck look so much smaller? It looks smaller than it should. Am I wrong? It's like a one quarter size fire truck. <laughs> That's bullshit, dude. I was hoping for some chungus, dude. Just barreling down this goddamn course. Oh god. We need to go. We need to go. This might be hard with a fire truck, dude. Oh, look at this. We're not even. We're not even a little bit on pace here to win this. Was there a key in that dinosaur's mouth? Let's go, let's go, we can win this. No! Fuck. We're gonna have to pull some shit out of our asses <laughs> to come in first here. Dude, that was like, it was close up until, it was close at the very end. But not the rest of the time. I was getting my ass beat. But you know what? We're gonna stick with it.
And you know what? I think what they're doing here are some of these courses the same, just with like some different obstacles or some shit, right? Haven't we done that course before, except it was just like with regular animals and now they just added some dinos to it? That's what it is, because we've done this one before too. Let's go, let's go. Good. Come on. Come on, we're spending it. I mean, don't get me wrong, the dinos are cool. This was like, this was the stage with the Yeti before, right? And we're going through the, oh god. This was the Primal Rage stage, dude. Let's go, let's go. Taking shortcuts? This is crazy. Okay. I just gotta get past these two fools. Somehow. Oh god. Not like this. No, 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 no. Get the big drift. Get that big drift going. Oh, yeah. Nope. Please. No. Second? Second place. We gotta like, we have to come in first on the last two tours now. Or we're screwed. <laughs> right? Fuck it. Yeah, the, um, fire truck is hard mode, dude. You just don't have the speed. I think, like, the downside with the bike is, like, its handling or its off-road ability was really bad, but I feel like that doesn't really... I don't know if that really impacts too much. <laughs> you know what I mean? What? Let's go. Oh, come on. Spend it. I don't- I actually don't remember this track. Or unless we did it like... Unless we did it at night or they changed it somehow. Oh god, we're almost there! Woo! Yo! What did I tell you guys? We needed first in the last two. We can still do this. We can legit still do this. Woo! We'll get the neon fire truck. I like the sound of that. Dino Janeiro, dude. We don't have the ATV yet either. Is there a tank in this game? <laughs> or is that just... There's gotta be a tank in the game, dude. Okay, here we go. Damn it. Didn't get starting way behind, dude. Does that give you a speed boost? It better. That one definitely does. Okay, we can't. 
Oh god, what happened? We're not doing good. Focus. Get the key? Sure. That may have not been a good time to use that. What the hell just happened? It's gonna happen. Oh man, I used my last nitrous already. I gotta pass just two more dudes. Okay. What the fuck? Did they take a shortcut? Did I just get screwed? Let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go! Okay, we got the two back-to-back -back first place finishes with the goddamn fire truck. Will it be enough? Will it be enough? Pucker them holes, boys. Give it to me straight. Oh. Oh. Are you serious? It wasn't... Uh, it wasn't enough, dude. You shitting on my nuts? <laughs> Come on, dude. Okay, guys, we'll be right back. We gotta unlock the goddamn UFO tour. We'll be right back. Okay, and we're back. We did it! We got the dino gold, man. I feel the gypped. <laughs> I got totally screwed, man. Two golds, a silver, and a bronze doesn't matter. Wasn't enough. Silver fucking trophy, dude. Uh, but that's okay. We did it. I got all golds that second time around. Do what the, do what I did. Do what I did differently. I used the goddamn bike. Check this shit out, dude. Space attack. Sentosa saucer. British invasion. Alien encounter. I wonder if there's another secret tour after this. What did we get? Are we serious? <laughs> yes. We gotta, right? Oh my god. Are, uh, are you serious? We're definitely riding the dino, dude. The Triceratops. The only thing that could make it better is if instead of it just being a goddamn Triceratops, it was a person riding a Triceratops. Yo. Go with the yellow dino. Put a body kit on him, dude. This is so ridiculous. Are we gonna drift as the dinosaur, dude? What is this? <laughs> this loading screen picture looks like that car is getting mounted. You know what I mean? <laughs> looks like he's getting a little frisky over there, dude. All right, let's do it. <laughs> There's a lineup of cars and the dino. Woo! Okay, Dido. Don't let me down. Like how he's got car noises, I expect nothing less. Okay, we're still in 10th. Doesn't bode well. Spend one. Oh my god, this shit is crazy. 
And I, I think one thing I realized that I'm doing that I could be doing differently is utilizing my boosts. Uh, I'm sorry, my drifts. Um, because the longer you drift, you'll get like a really like big boost out of it. And you can just keep it going. Like right now, once it turns purple, then you'll actually get like a really significant boost out of it. So we gotta keep it going. Even when it's like after the turn. See? Look at the air that we got, dude. Let's use a nitrous. Increase the lead. Let's use our other nitrous. We're in the home stretch. Yes! First place. Just the kookiest. The kookiest horse shit. I love it. Very cool. One thing they mentioned in the, um, that Digital Foundry video that I was talking about Ready, set. is apparently they, they made some pretty, like, significant changes to the graphics compared to the arcade version. And I haven't seen what the arcade one looks like. One thing, too, about your drift is that you can actually change the direction of your drift. So here we can actually change it. Oh god! So you don't really want to hit the wall. Oh god. Shortcuts, boys. We're not doing very well. We're hitting way too many walls. Oh, I missed the key? Are you serious? Damn it. We got a lot of ground to make up. We got no more nitrous. We're in trouble. We're in trouble. Actually, it's gonna be toy. Oh, we'll see if we can find a shortcut, please. I don't know if that really helped us. At the very end, clutching it out. Clutching it out, dude. Because, yeah, we should definitely try to get gold here. In case something else does get unlocked. Yo, we got the Triceratops Neon after two races? For reals? Um, what was I saying? The, yeah, the the like the graphics are quite a bit different in this one compared to the uh, the actual arcade version. Um, like I don't I don't know how significant I haven't looked it up, but I'm curious to like look at a side by side comparison because I think those like raw thrills like PC games, I mean uh, arcade games, I think they just run on like a PC, right? I think they're technically all just arcade machines these days. They're just like computers. Oh god. Good. Yes. Get out of my way, dude. Don't fuck with a rampaging dino, dude. Are you kidding me right now? Shit. Oh, we haven't used any nitrous. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. No! Fourth place. 
I didn't realize how short that course was. You guys, they that may have cost us everything. I don't I don't even know if three first place finishes and a fourth will be enough to get gold. Holy That was rough, dude. And I was just sitting on all that nitrous, dude. There's a 45 second track. Okay. Here we go. We did unlock the ATV though. But the stats on it kind of suck. Like it's got low speed, but it's like really high off-road stats, but I was like, when's that gonna be like useful, you know? Alright. Fuck it. We need to get first. This is a must first place scenario. A must first. See, once the drift turns purple, that's when you know you're good to go. See how the smoke changes? Oh god, I fucked it! Damn it, I let go a little too early. Woo! That's right, bitch. We might just want to burn one of these, dude. Oh, there's a key there. I want to save my last nitrous in case, like, I really need it or some shit. Let's take this one. It looks more narrow. Maybe that means it's short. I don't know where that logic comes from, but... God damn it. Here we go, here we go. This is actually good. This is good. I'm using my other burst. Ooh, we took out that motherfucker, dude! Oh god. Oh god. Third place. No! Come on, dude! What happened, dude? <laughs> it's not enough, dude. Still super fun, right? I don't I don't recall what the dino's speed was like. Woo! <laughs> Look at this fool go though, man. The best. Super fun game. Dude, I just I shit the bed. We still got silver. That's kinda cool. I don't think we're gonna unlock anything else. I don't know if we will. Nope, that is it. God damn. So if it turns out there is another cup after this, <laughs> then I'll, I'll continue the recording. But if not, then that's gonna be it for uh, cruising, guys, for cruising and blast. And honestly, you guys, if this gameplay interests you at all, um, you should definitely check the game out and consider picking it up. Just uh, to support these dudes, Raw Thrills, man. They're just, uh, I don't know, they're just, they, they, you can tell that they're passionate about, about arcade games and like that classic arcade style. <laughs> and it definitely like shows and it's super fun. And it's like, it's actually made by a really small team. If you go to the game's credits, if you actually go to the, where is it? Where the? Yeah, if you actually go to the credits, dude, Eugene Jarvis, look at this team, dude. <sighs> Not a lot of people. That's kind of insane. That's insane, right? The biggest chunk of this is families, dude. <laughs> so you definitely, you gotta give it up to these dudes, man. And, uh, 
yeah, I would love to see more of their stuff uh, released. I would love to see this on like PC or something like that. But again, I don't know where the cruising IP is at. Um, but anyways, you guys, I hope you enjoyed watching and um, we'll be back. I'm, I think we might check out some of the N64 cruising games, possibly. Stay tuned for that. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Peace.